Hold on. Give me like 10 seconds. I see that you're the new fabric cutter at Joanne's Fabrics. There's a hierarchy in this Joanne's Fabrics. Ring the, ring, come on. Hello. Hi, Shane? Yes. You have HPV. <laughs> what the? <laughs> the counts, that was two of my jokes combined with one of your jokes. I'm Shane Top, and today I have agreed to sit down and interview several of my exes. I haven't talked to a lot of them since the breakups. I think some were on good terms, some not. Uh, so we'll see how this is gonna go. Hi. The last time we saw each other, you left me at a bus station in Atlantic City. Yeah. What initially attracted you to me? The way you sleep. Okay. Eyes open. Oh, I sleep. I didn't realize I sleep with my eyes open. I have three million pictures. That's quite a bit. So what was our first date like? Forbidden city of Atlantis. Atlantis? We, yes. What kind of food did they have there again? Um, hot dogs. I think we went to Six Flags. <laughs> What's my worst quality? Lying to me, saying that you loved me. What about all the sweet nothings you used to whisper in my ear while I was sitting on the toilet? <laughs> <laughs> Taking my <laughs> mouth of shits. <laughs> you would kneel next to the toilet yeah. as I'm taking my huge sh**. I would whisper. And you would whisper in my ear saying, I love you, Chosen. Because it would help you? Yes. Could you if I wasn't doing that? I haven't sh in seven years. <laughs> You ever just list, sit in a dark room and just play construction sounds? No. Jackhammering? No. That is what it's like kissing you. Did you ever cheat on me? Yes. You did? Does it hurt? Uh, a little bit, yeah. When you fell from heaven? What? <laughs> <laughs> if you had the last word, what would you say? I'm also pregnant. How about a hug? For old time's sake. <sighs> okay. I'm pregnant. Hello, it's me, Thomas Jefferson. <laughs> Welcome to Chili's. Damien Haas, and today I will be reconnecting with some exes. Of course I'm nervous about it. I, I, I don't stay in the most contact with them, so we'll, we'll see how this goes. Oh. Yum, breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. You look really great. It's great to see you again. And you look like a young Miles Teller. <laughs> um, Augustus. Yes. <laughs> that is my name. Yes. Always has been, always will be. Consistency was always so <laughs> strong with you. What initially, <laughs> it is hard on the other end. It really is hard to see. Um, <laughs> what initially attracted you to me? Yep. Oh. Yep. Mm. Game recognized game, so you get it. <laughs> the first time I saw you, 
was on this little streaming platform called Twitch. Mm -hmm. I started sending you many hateful comments, it's, and I you that. kept rebuking them. And so I thought, wow, hmm, this could be my little pet project. You're like the American Idol. You are very commercial, and um, you appeal to the masses. And I've never dated anybody like you before. You know, they say don't go chasing waterfalls unless the waterfalls are melted butter and gogurt. And that is what I did. You always had such a way with words. Yes. I think you truly are the best and funniest character here. Yes. Oh. What is my biggest flaw? Your biggest flaw was your intolerance to nuts, butters, but and your cats. Cats, yeah. It's good though, because very I, generic cats. Very basic. Very, very basic, basic generic cats. Nothing too special about them. No. I keep trying to train them to do awesome shit. They just lay there. Yes, yeah, and yes. and they're unable to eat foods that I like, mm. for, like mozzarella cheese. One time I fed them some cheese sticks and they steak. threw up. Yep. And I said, wow, very, very weak, generic, basic cats. So Augustus, I know we hashed oh. this out seemingly ad nauseum. No. And that does add some nauseum mm. to me. Um, why, why did we break up? Mm. The reason why we broke up was because mm. you were on a competing platform called Twitch and uh, I'm on Yelp. It was like a little bit of like a little Romeo and Juliet. I was the Juliet, the Romeo. <laughs> you know, even though that response was difficult to hear and at times understand, um, I gotta rate it useful, funny, and cool. Sorry, what are you speaking of? It's the three ways that you can rate a Yelp review. It was useful, there funny, There you go or cool. again, telling me what I do. You asked me. No, I... That's literally gaslighting. If no, you ask you are, me and then you I are answer gaslighting and I'm mad at me. Speaking of gaslighting... <laughs> All right. I love drinking gasoline. Things are cooking up? Oh, got it. Did you keep any secrets from me? When you were sleeping, I would open up your little mouth um, and I would put man names in them. Oh, you put what? Man name! <laughs> man name! No, I get it now. Right, right, right. God, it is rough on the other end. That's wild. If you had the last word, what would you say? I would rate this place one star. This place is incompetent at its best, and the manager here is unprofessionalism at its peak. With my pizza order, I always order extra pepperoncini and garlic butter sauce. Then today my order comes with one extra garlic sauce, and I specifically explained to the person over the phone. The entire extra thing, I had no problem playing for it, but she was like, whoa, you really like garlic butter. What can I say? What can you say? I, I have no f clue at this point. <laughs> You're the you're the best one here, and I, I want to see you in more things, man. I'll see you later. Goodbye, Augustus. Goodbye. Mm. <laughs> nom, 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 nom. Oh, gonna take a sip of my morning cup of dough. Crab stack. Crabby. I'll hold it. <laughs> I love the flavor of HP laser jet. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Augustus. I am a five-star Yelp reviewer and I was told that this event was going to be catered by Auntie Anne's pretzels. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just say Damien's death is the second biggest disappointment of the day. <laughs> oh. Oh. I wouldn't say Damien was a close friend of mine. I would say mm, our relationship was more of a restaurant patron and server who keeps checking on me and won't just let me eat. <laughs> that being said, as a member of the Yelp Elite Squad, sorry for bragging, not sorry, I will now be conducting a review of Damien's life. Atmosphere. Three stars. Damien has a fun, approachable atmosphere with the Hollywood flair. He looked like a John Hamm if John Hamm only ate at a Cracker Barrel. <laughs> Marketing. Two stars. Damien's Twitter featured amazing content like delaying his Twitch streams and the most mid cat you have ever seen. <laughs> to Damien for his influencer marketing strategy, which was that every time he posted something branded on Instagram, he would force all of his friends to like it and comment. <laughs> the core, zero stars. Damien's style was, 
I hated it. <laughs> Do you like ever just like cringe at people? That's what I did for Damien. <laughs> what? But Damien was more than just terrible clothing. He also had blue hair. He looked like an Aquafina water bottle cap, but inside he was more like the Sonny. <laughs> Health score. Two stars. While I do miss Damien's Jack in the Box era, I sometimes worried for his health. He had the complexion of an antique Victorian doll and was fragile like one too. <laughs> Opening hours. One star. Damien's hours were confusing. You're never quite sure when you'd see him. And when he was open, he was way too open. <laughs> okay, here are some recommendations based on popular items on Damien's menu. If you visit Damien, you have to try virtue signaling. <laughs> but stay away from his personal space or having any lights on in the room or making him think that you're mad at him or making him think you're mad at him for thinking that you're mad at him or telling him to stop apologizing or making any kind of loud noise or soft noise or any noise. <laughs> Don't make noise. <laughs> As a Yelp elite, no matter how negative my review is, I will always leave an establishment with a big tip. So, Damien, stick to the games channel. <laughs> Hello? Uh, my name is Sarah Christ? And this is my Harper's Bazaar morning routine video. <laughs> okay, so the first thing I do in the morning is I brush my teeth with cigarettes and, oh, hold on, give me that. <laughs> the most important part. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> It's really crazy that I just did that. <laughs> okay. The second thing that I do as Sarah Christ is I call 911. Can I speak to Michelle? They know me there by name. Okay, that's all that I have. <laughs> Twice. <laughs> <sighs> 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 Where were you on the night of the 13th? <laughs> English. <laughs> Hello, everyone. <laughs> I'm ex detective Sarah Christ. <laughs> you likely know me from my work. Hunting down the Creekside Killer. <laughs> but <laughs> you might also know me from my picture hanging up at O'Malley's Tavern. <laughs> I have the record time on the mechanical bull. I don't have much time to talk. I double parked my car on a playground. Um, so. <laughs> I'm here because I have a confession to make. I've been tracking down Amanda's whereabouts for the better half of a year now. Okay, so now listen. I am no stranger to stalking people in the night, but this time, it was personal. Amanda Lehan Canto murdered my ex-partner by hugging them too hard after a group Pilates class. <laughs> <laughs> she hugs with such aggression, it is f***ing disgusting. The sheer force of the hug crushed their spine like a can of Diet Coke. I only wish I could have been there to save my partner but they don't allow smoking and Pilates. <laughs> she was a true master of disguise, constantly personifying different wigged maidens with smooth caramel voices. <laughs> there was only one time I saw her in her natural form, in an ill-fitted target dress and a four-year-old bangs. <laughs> I had to get closer. 
I enrolled in one of her improv classes at the local community center. She taught us how to be as loud as possible and leave no room for others to contribute. <laughs> I wasn't cut out for improv because I kept questioning the truth. <laughs> as I continued to observe her, the unthinkable happened. I got too deep. Before I knew it, I, Sir Christ, had fallen deeply in love with Amanda Lehan Canto. I suddenly realized we were meant to be. Her last name is Lehan Canto, and I had to leave Encanto because I kept telling the children to quiet down. <laughs> Do you all know Encanto? The movie about a magic house. <laughs> There's only one magic house I am aware of, and that is the courthouse. <laughs> <laughs> and look, I'm not just in love with her spirit, but also her body. She's built like a substitute teacher. <laughs> <laughs> oh Let's just God. say I wasn't a wet cop until I met Amanda. <laughs> I learned that Amanda loves drinking skin contact wine. God, if I could make contact with her skin, I would never whine. <laughs> they say the Creekside Killer is still at large. And you know what else is large? Her breasts. Yep. <laughs> so I, I want to leave all of you with a promise. I will find her killer. I will hunt night and day to who, figure out who did this. If you need me, I will be at O'Malley's Tavern riding the mechanical bull. Sayonara. That's it. <laughs> oh, man. Hello there, I'm Noah Grossman, and I'm about to meet my exes. Ow, 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 titties. <laughs> okay, <laughs> legs for days. <laughs> Kimber, yeah? Did you almost forget my name? I just, I wanted to make sure. <laughs> I'm not very good with names. It's probably all the weed you're eating. <laughs> what initially attracted you to me? Your daddy. My dad? Your daddy. My daddy. Mm -hmm. So you started dating me to get closer to my dad? Forbidden love. They say don't go chasing Nigerian falls. <laughs> <laughs> what would you say is my biggest flaw? What, what can I work on? All you did was, you know, you would just eat Cheerio water, <laughs> weed, and you know, I just needed to be with a big man. Like, you were just so malnutritioned, and I'm just a really sweet, small girl, and I just need to be with someone, a man, who can donate gallons of blood. <laughs> Why did we break up? I just, I hated your brothers. I hated them. I sent them photos of my feet, and they told me to stop. <laughs> Like, so rude, you should beat them up. Metaphorically. Metaphorically. I'm seducing you right now. It's it's working. That, the tomol is really working. I can put my body into different shapes. Like this one, what do you call this one? S. S? Wow, S. E. <laughs> Why? Why? Did you leave me? <laughs> Did you keep any secrets from me while we were together? Can I have my telephone? I wrote you a poem. Oh my goodness, thank you. Can I listen? So you want to play with magic? Boy, you should know what you're falling for. Baby, do you dare to do this? Because I'm coming at you like a dark horse. Are you ready for, ready for? A perfect storm, a perfect storm. Because once you're mine, once you're mine, there's no going back. Wow, I believe that's an original song by you. Yeah, <laughs> I wrote it. You wrote Katy Perry's Dark Horse? <laughs> Who's that? <laughs> Keisha, that's my baby? This is your baby! Look at him, it's so beautiful. Yeah, I no, I, I see, oh, yeah, it's so oh, beautiful. Yeah. Keisha, we broke up in 2017. Oh. <laughs> We've been raising her together. <laughs> your, your wig's slipping. Throw your toenails at me! Thank you, Bye. <laughs> <laughs>
This is a this is a crazy secret. You've been keeping a child from me. You've been raising. Yes. With Kimber. Yes. We actually do enjoy each other a lot. I love you, baby. I love you too, baby. <laughs> if you had the last word in our relationship, what would it be? Don't put your eggs in one casket. <laughs> I guess not at a little. Oh, my limousine is here. <laughs> your lim this is your limousine? See, this is a real man this who, do who do can donate 300 gallons of blood. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> bye bye, Kimber. I hope. <laughs> bye, sweetie. Goodbye. Dodged a bullet. Hi, I'm Tommy. Tommy Bo from Smosh. Today I'm going to be interviewing my exes, and I have no idea what the hell's going to happen. I'm very scared. Hello! It is your mental illness! <laughs> <laughs> I've never had it done to me! <laughs> wow! You look terrible! <laughs> oh, look! Can I have an autograph? Big uh, Little Lies? Old lady oh, from Big I'm Little not, Lies? Oh, sure. <laughs> and I'm not that old. You're probably like 75. Oh, that's just so harsh. <laughs> I'm 65. Mental illness, your accent has definitely changed. Oh, yes! Okay. <laughs> what a nightmare. Uh, mental illness, I just gotta say, how's that Wellbutrin treating you? I gotta say, I'm having a blast not seeing you that often. Well, don't worry, it's gonna stop working very soon. <laughs> You shit your little mouth. Okay. <laughs> uh, this can go toward anyone. Um, what initially attracted you to me? Well, you were made in Florida, and you live in LA, and you work here, and you don't drink any water. <laughs> that, yeah, that makes Easy sense. Easy target. <laughs> so your dating life went <laughs> downhill. You're very exotic. Uh. How am I exotic? <laughs> oh. Oh, because he poo pooed himself in fourth grade. And a few years ago in New York. What's supposed to signal to me that you're gay? And I love musical theater. Me too. <laughs> Don't see guys and dolls too. Awful. Too many dolls, not enough guys. Mental illness don't see color at all. <laughs> Mental illness, what's your favorite memory of us? Oh yes, of course. My favorite time with you is when we would um, undress ourselves and look, at, and look in the mirror and uh, you would cry, I would laugh. And because I make you see things that is not actually real. In a metaphorical sense, mental illness, what's it like to kiss me? Your kisses were so good because you practiced on feel of the future for like 10 hours a day. Who read my diary? <laughs> <laughs> this is demonic. <laughs> mental illness, why did we break up? You started saying no! I'm setting boundaries, and you started taking Tylenol AM, PM all the time. And believe it or not, you can't get rid of me with meal prep. It's been working so far. Do you have well, a secret I'll plan? Back. I'll be back. <laughs> I'll be back like I always no, do. No, you won't be back. Yes, I will. No, you won't will. be back. Yes, I will. <laughs> You're not coming back, okay? Uh, we, we broke up because I'm taking care of myself and because I kind of got Good. into the hump Oh, stuff, you will okay? come back to me. Mental illness, uh, what did you- Present. What did and you- And all of us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What did you learn from dating me? Well, I learned all the choreography to Dance Moms. We watched it every day, every week, every month, and every year. I don't want to be mental illness anymore. You don't want to be mental uh. illness? <laughs> Just kidding! <laughs> I just want to say you make great music. That means nothing coming from you. I know! <laughs> Mental illness. If you had the last word, what would you say? Well, I would like to say, Tommy, that um, I love you. Aww. Hello, I am Courtney Miller, and today I am interviewing more of my exes. Okay, tell them that I will show my asshole for free! For free! <laughs> oh, God. oh my God! <laughs> Hey. I had a big cup of OJ and I'm feeling really horny. <laughs> <laughs> you look really good. Hey. Hi. Hey. <laughs> Where are your guys' teeth? <laughs> Mine came out when I roller skated full speed at a brick building. I left mine at Sephora. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
Oh my gosh, Brianna Boho, it's it's great to see you. You look really good. Thanks, sexy. Brianna Boho, what initially attracted you to me? Sorry. <laughs> There's so many cameras. <laughs> um, we met at Sephora Jail. You, um, Sephora yeah, it exists. Jail? You were stealing Kat Von D eyeliner and shape mm -hmm. tape. And I was like testing foundations on my ass <laughs> and lip gloss. And apparently, I, I like you can't do that. So stupid. Like <laughs> policy or whatever. So we were both sent to. Sephora jail? <laughs> Sorry, he's hot. <laughs> do you think if we like do you think if we um had sex our children won't have teeth either? Oh, God. I have all my teeth. I have all my teeth. So. Cool. Um, <laughs> so yeah, um we met in jail <clears throat> and <clears throat> <laughs> Sorry, I also have asthma. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we met in Sephora jail, and then I was like, oh my god, you look like Olivia Newton John. Mm -hmm. oh, sorry, I met Olive and Fig Newtons. Because you're a snack. <laughs> <laughs> what is your favorite memory of us, Sunny? <laughs> sorry. When you said crazy, I just like thought of my favorite song. Which one? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> I know that song. It's a good song. I know which one. I know that one too. No. <laughs> okay, Brianna. What? Question for him. Okay. Sean? Yeah. What's your Sunny. Sunny. Oh, sorry. Did you also get a nose job? No, I, I smashed into a brick building skating full force at it. Dr. Anastasia? <laughs> no. She did your nose too. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I, um, I've got interesting taste, as you have quickly learned. Brianna Boho? Yeah. What was your That's favorite it. memory of us? When we did a photo shoot outside of um, the animal shelter, and um, I couldn't get inside because um, dogs have a restraining order against me because they're <laughs> bitches. Uh -huh. And like that was a really good day because um, we got some really good photos. And um, yeah. Mm -hmm. You want to guess? Well, one time I had sex so hard I broke my spine. You probably wouldn't be walking if you broke your spine. <laughs> You don't know anything. Look at this. His ass. That yes. is his ass. Good. <laughs> I want to kiss her. Okay. Well, that's me. So just remember that. Oh. Wow. Wow. I'll pay so much more. It's for so that much now. better now. Yeah. Now that's a, that's an album cover. That's pretty good. Brianna, why did we break up? We broke up because obviously you were just like not on my level of horniness. I was, I'm very horny, and you're not, and I'm very horny for money, I'm very kinky for fame, and you just weren't, so. Well, who, what's your ideal situation then, like? Ideal situation is if those shoes were on you, <laughs> and that face was on this body. <laughs> so you're saying I got a good body. Brianna Boho, what was it like to kiss me? Um, um, you were, you burp a lot, so like, it I was do. like every time our lips touched, you, it, you would like blow this thing into my mouth and... Ah, CPR. I'm sorry, I, that sounds awful about burping in your mouth. I'm sorry, Brianna. I liked it. Brianna Boho. Present. Did, did you keep any secrets when we were together? Of course. Yeah. I'm a lady of mystery. One time I peed in your purse. <laughs> I completely peed in your purse. <laughs> okay, why? Um, because like, you know, like when like dogs, like they pee to uh, um, mark their territory. Right. You were mine. That's pretty disgusting, Brianna. What? It's hot. You were into that. I don't think I said anything about being into pissing in my bag. But that's um, not what you said. What did I say? You what? didn't say. You said I'm. I like piss, and <laughs> <laughs> I feel so vulnerable right now. 
We are being very vulnerable. Right? I'm sorry. I don't mean to make you feel bad for it. Like, I asked, you know. I'm sorry. It's my fault. We're together. Okay. Oh. What the f <laughs> You guys. I'm just along for the ride. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. We hugged up. All right. We when? I don't remember, no. but I'm our, I consent. <laughs> <laughs> Please, please. <laughs> Brianna Boho, what did you learn from dating me? I've never learned a lesson. You've never learned a lesson? Uh-uh. All right, well, I'm sorry I couldn't teach you anything. Did I teach you anything? Yeah, you tell me to be confident in my body. That's right. You tell me how to get lip lipstick on my cheek a little bit. It's just part of my look. <laughs> Brianna Boho, if you had, oh, if you had the last word, what? <laughs> What would be? If you, hey, if you had the last word, what would you say? Toxic shock! Shit! <laughs> 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 oh my God. We just had like. 30 mimosas together, yeah. it was bottomless. And we're power bottom, so we really pushed that limit. Speak for yourself. I'm really big up top, too. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> oh, hi. I am Brianna Boho. I learned a new word today. Are you ready? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mamma mia. <laughs> wow. wow. <laughs> So great. We had too many mimosas this morning. Yeah, Mama Mia Mosas. Yeah. I put up uh, three bags of airheads in mine. <laughs> <laughs> hey. I purposefully had them remove my toes. Like that. <laughs> Like, a spring. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. And wow. Oh my god. That's like That's favorite that holiday. Do, Do I? You keep going. I think yeah. you keep, like, I almost. This is like scary because I almost thought I had it and then Gunnery I. Gonorrhea. Like, no, the other one. Gonorrhea. Yeah. No, like you like. Purpose. You like are walking for like really long. Chasing time. Blister. Oh. Blister. Oh, like a Blister. side effect. <laughs> Love like them. that Bill Paxton movie. But I say like I have milk so much. Um, he also milk was like a bad choice. Going clear. Dear. <laughs> <laughs> it's my turn again. Uh, it's going um, clear. I'm gonna need more help. This is like you know how he says um, San San Diego stands for a whale's vagina. Oh, I. I <laughs> Oh, it's the it's, it's the, the anchor man. Has, yeah, it's anchor man. Babe, so you're not on So we got the point. Yeah, yeah. you yeah. did. Yeah. 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 Like when you have clout, right? Land before yeah. time. When you have clout, you're what? Just rich. It's like mm -hmm. the walk of shame. Yeah. And shame. So you have <laughs> and, and so you have clout. Shame. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it rhymes with that. Game. Another word that rhymes with that. Same. Maybe go back to the Lame. Alphabet. No. Game. The other way. Mm -hmm. Kiana's tired. Kind of like Leonardo DiCaprio. Actor. Study. I think we're done. <laughs> what was it? Same. Same. Oh my god. That was actually really hard. <laughs> Would it be so crazy to tell you guys I'm an undercover cop? I think I that would be crazy. crazy. Yeah. I'm not. This is something this. that I would like to have. Like, um, like I wish I could have this. Wow. Um, like I can Ten like at once. A, a football field. Yeah, and then I can like roam, like around. Crazy. The ability to fly. Pasture. No, no like kind of like I. Frolic. Like if yeah. I had like Ooh, a, wings. Like a big. <laughs> 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 Even juicier dumper. Yeah. What is it? Free range. Um, oh. 
<laughs> this is something that I am. Hats. <laughs> no, Hats. the other one. Like so a so <laughs> titty. Like, like a cheese it. I'm not Hi. done yet. A wrap? Like a like a cheese it. Like a cheese it is like Smelly. no, Smelly. like cheese it uh, funions. Like a snack. Yes. Process. This is a snack. This is my favorite Taylor Swift song. Red story. Like, I can hold my breath under water for six minutes and do math problems. I think we all have a certain kind of expertise, and then she's a sleeper agent. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think her activation sentence is? Oh. Ah. Mm. Uh? No, because it's too often. You don't. Oh. You don't. It's probably when she finally loses her virginity. That's what it is. That's why she's never had it. Oh. Uh, the government invested two million dollars in me. To watch. Hopefully, I'm in both of them.